What's up, you guys? It's Levi here. So last August, I did a video on everything you guys need to know about VPNs, or also known as virtual private networks. I'll post a link down below in the description for you guys to check that out if you want to learn what a VPN is and why you need a VPN. So I was sitting there in my comfy chair the other day and I realized I never did a video teaching you guys how to set up a VPN and how to use a VPN. And I was like, I have to do a video on this. So guess what? I will be doing a multi-part video on how to use ExpressVPN and how to set up ExpressVPN. Today I will be specifically doing a video on how to set up ExpressVPN on PC or Windows machines, but in the very near future, I will also be doing videos on how to set up ExpressVPN on iOS devices, so iPhones and iPads, and also on Android devices. So make sure that if you haven't already that you're smashing that subscribe button and smashing that notification bell so that you can be notified as soon as those videos come out. And while you're at it, since the button is not very far, make sure you're smashing that like button for the YouTube algorithm. That way more people can see this content and be able to help themselves from the cybersecurity threats that are out there in the world. Also, if you happen to decide that you want ExpressVPN, check out the link down below in the description. If you use that link, it will give you a free 30-day trial of ExpressVPN, and it also helps me out for creating this content because I don't get paid currently to put out content on this channel. So make sure you're using that link down below if you want to get ExpressVPN. Also, finally, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I would love to hear from you guys. All right, so let's go ahead and let's get into this tutorial for you guys. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the ExpressVPN tutorial. All right, so the first thing that you all are going to do is you're going to go down below, down to the description, and smash that Get Express VPN link that's down below. And while you're at it, make sure you're smashing that like button for the YouTube algorithm as well. All right, so once you smash that link, um, you're gonna get to this page here. And what you're gonna do on this page here is click that Get 30 Days Free button because what's greater than getting something free for 30 days? So then once you click that button, you'll get to this page where you choose your ExpressVPN plan. I um, mean, you have three different options that you can pick from on this page. You can choose option one where you have a one month where you get it for $12.95 a month. Um, you can choose the 12 month option where you can get it for $8.32 a month. And you can choose the six month option where you can get it for $9.99 a month. Fortunately, with all these plans, you'll be able to get 30 days free, 100% money back guarantee if you cancel within your first 30 days of using this product. So um, it's a pretty good deal. You can try it out. And if you don't like it, you can cancel and not pay anything. So I personally, myself, I use a 12 month version uh, because I like this product and I've been using it for years. And it's the cheapest to do it at that rate because I'm only paying $8.32 a month versus $9.99 a month for six months or $12.95 a month for one month. It's up to you what route you guys want to take. But if I were you, I would probably go with the $12.95 a month option just because you're relatively new. And if you decide that you don't like it after two months because you'll have that free 30 days plus a month, then you can go ahead and cancel and you don't have to pay extra money, right? So that's the option I would go with if I were you, but you guys can pick whatever you want. So, all right, once you decide what option you want to pick, um, you're going to go ahead and scroll down and, you know, do the basic sign up that you would do on any application. So you're going to fill out your email address and then select what method you want to use to pay for ExpressVPN. 
it's kind of interesting they even allow Bitcoin on here so if you're a Bitcoin type person you can use that to pay as well all right so I'm not going to show you the rest of the sign up part because it should be pretty basic if you've signed up for anything else and I already have a subscription and don't want to pay for ExpressVPN again so I'm not going to take you through that part the next part I'll take you through is what to do after you've signed up. If you have any questions on the sign up though, leave them down below in the comments. I'd be glad to answer those for you. All right, so the next phase here, once you're all signed up, is to go to expressvpn.com and you'll go ahead and click on that My Account button there. Once you do that, then you'll go ahead and you'll see a sign in page to sign into ExpressVPN with the username and password that you created. All right, once you do that, then you'll get to this page. And on this page, you'll see an option to download ExpressVPN for Windows. You'll also see an option down here with an activation code that I have blurred out because I don't want you guys to see my activation code. Save that because you'll need that later when we go to set up ExpressVPN after we download it. But for now, I'll go ahead and click the download for Windows button. And you can see that it's downloaded. So now, Let's go ahead and let's run that installer. Run it and click yes. And then it'll install. All right, so once it's installed, then you have to go ahead and click that sign in button. Click yes again. Wait for it to load. All right, so remember when I talked about how you'll want that key? Here is where you enter that key. So go back to the ExpressVPN page that you logged into and grab that key and paste it in here all right and then it signs in and then right here you'll get a screen that will tell you to launch on startup um, you can decide whether you want to or not if you want to be on a VPN all the time if you're worried about privacy and you want to be protected all the time or you're traveling all the time and you just want it on um, you can select okay but me personally I don't like to have it on all the time I have gig internet and the VPN is slower than my internet, so I only like to use it um, when I have privacy sessions that I'm taking or if I'm traveling. So I'm going to leave it off and select no thanks for now. Um, you can, and then you have the option whether you want to help improve ExpressVPN. Um, you can decide what you want to do on that. I'm just going to say no thanks in this situation. All right, so here we go. Here's the meat of ExpressVPN. So if we click this little button right here, these three dots, um, you can pick whatever location that you want of the available locations. Um, you can pick one of the recommended locations or you can do what I like to do. You can go into all locations and pick wherever you want to be at in the world. So uh, if I happen to decide, hey, I want to be in the United States and I want to be in Chicago since that's the closest place to me, I can go ahead and select that and smash that big red power button here to connect and guess what my internet is now connected as Chicago so anytime I'm visiting a website or application on the web it's going to see me as I've as if I'm in Chicago um, I can prove that to you real quick a good way to check this is just to do a Google search for what is my IP You can see that your public IP address is this, but that's probably meaning, meaningless to most of you. So let's just go ahead and let's go to whatismyipaddress.com. And you can see the city right here is Chicago. All right, so let's go back and let's go to a different um, location now. In order to do that, you can go either down here or there's an option over here if you happen to have this hidden where you can just right click and go into it this way as well actually it's left click I mean when you like left, left click it'll pop up like this um, and then you can just go over here and change your option let's say that we want to be in Europe now so we'll scroll down to Europe um, I want to be in Germany and let's just say Frankfurt continue and then once you select that, it will automatically try to connect. Boom. And now we are showing up to everyone else on the web that we're in Frankfurt, Germany. So if I go to this whatsmyipaddress.com and refresh the site. 
boom, shows that you're in Germany. All right, so that's how you set up and use ExpressVPN on PCs or Windows devices. Remember, if you guys need a refresher on what a VPN is and why you need a VPN, check out the link down below in the description from the video I did last August on everything you guys need to know about VPNs. Also, make sure that you're staying tuned for future videos on how to set up ExpressVPN and use ExpressVPN on other devices as they will be coming out very, very soon. And make sure you're smashing that like button, hitting that subscribe button, <laughs> and hitting that notification bell so that you're notified when those videos come out. And also all these actions help promote this channel up on YouTube so more people like you can see this content and help protect themselves from the cybersecurity threats in the world and taking down the hackers or what we like to call the pirates on this channel. I thank you guys so much for watching. Have a fantastic day.